So this is a great day for our city as, as uh, we uh, once again are, have been honored by the State Auditor's Office with uh, an award of distinction today. And we are extraordinarily pleased to be joined by our Auditor of State, Mr. Dave Yost, who has been uh, no stranger to our community, has been a great friend to the City of Mender, has been very helpful with us in so many, uh, so many different regards. We've been able to partner uh, with his office to uh, do some some innovative things around the state to be among the first to participate in some resource sharing uh, projects in Lake County and, and, and to introduce software and a model that's been used elsewhere successfully in the state and going to uh, uh, forward one of the missions both of I know uh, Mr. Yost's office and ours which is to save the taxpayers dollars wherever we can. So it's my great pleasure to introduce to you today, our Auditor of State, Mr. Dave Yost. Thank you, Ken. Uh, and I have to say, I, I love being back in Mentor, uh, seeing a couple of friends who helped with that uh, resource uh, sharing project. And uh, you know, frankly, Mentor has, uh, always been during uh, my time as state auditor, which now is eight years and drawing to a close, uh, has been a leader and an innovator, uh, as well as a, a, a thrifty steward of taxpayer dollars. So it's uh, good, to, good to be back here among friends. Uh, usually people are not very happy when they see the auditor walk through the door uh, for obvious reasons. I mean, we're here to check the books and test the controls and see how we're doing. And, and frankly, we often, uh, part of our job is to f pick some nits or find things that are wrong. Uh, so I told my staff early on that uh, when we're out there looking and what we find is good, when we find excellence, I'd like to note that as well and not simply uh, always be the bearer of bad news. And uh, so today, uh, is part of that, uh, that process. We uh, issue the Auditor of State's Award to those entities that have a clean uh, financial audit. And that means more than just the, the dollars and cents line up. It means that the transactions are uh, posted correctly, that the, the, uh, the internal controls are not only present but being executed. And we also look for compliance with state law. Uh, and if we find anything wrong, it, that's disqualifying for the award. These are objective criteria that are on our website. Uh, this is not a, a friend of Dave kind of thing. You actually have to do the work and meet the, uh, and meet the criteria. The Auditor of State's Award with distinction only goes to those entities that have the clean audit and uh, they, uh, produce a CAFR, which is a comprehensive annual financial report, the gold standard for uh, public fund accounting. Uh, who, who prepares or who works on the, on the CAFR? Okay. Uh, congratulations. I know from my time as a county auditor that that's a lot of work. So uh, I guess the last thing I want to mention is you might be thinking, well, doesn't everybody get this? Clean audit, that's what we all want, right? Uh, and the, the fact of the matter is uh, only about 5% of the entities that we audit actually achieve uh, the Auditor of State's Award with Distinction, which uh, puts you in elite company in terms of your financial record keeping. Credit goes to not just the finance staff, but also key executive staff. Uh, Ken, you've got a good team here, uh, because unless they actually follow uh, and execute the controls and follow policy and the uh, city ordinances, the appropriation ordinances. Doesn't matter how good the finance staff is, you've got to have management on board too. And of course, council plays a role in the budgetary process. So uh, the bottom line is, uh, while and David uh, name goes on this, uh, it's actually uh, 
the his leadership, but belongs to the entire city because it is a team effort. So with that, it gives me great pleasure to, uh, on behalf of the people of Ohio, thank and congratulate the city of Mentor, Ohio, uh, for winning the uh, Ohio Auditor of States Award with distinction. David? Thank you, Mr. Yost. Um, it, it'll be a little repetitive, but uh, I would also like to extend my thanks to the numerous appropriation revisions that our council approves throughout the year, and, and they know what I'm talking about there. Uh, our city manager's support uh, for the entire effort, 2017, quite frankly, was a year that we contemplated filing an extension on our audit with the support of our management, particularly our city manager. We trudged on and we got to the finish line and I also would like to thank our audit outside independent accounting firm Zupka CPA and for their efforts. Um, this was probably our most challenging CAFR prep and we take great pride in preparing that document internally. We are one of the few entities statewide that prepare the entire CAFR front to cover in-house. And uh, we're very proud of that. And uh, this is a little bit special, this particular one for 2017, because it wasn't easy. <laughs> and it is a tribute to our entire staff, council, and city, the city manager's office. Um, I would invite all the staff to st step up and also receive the award. Thank you.